Hi, Beverly. Uh, for those of you that don't know who I am, my name is Paul Guanci, and I'm the current City Council President here in Beverly, Massachusetts. Uh, it's a position I've held the past six years. Uh, I've been on the council for a number of years, and I'm running for re-election this year against a very, very strong field. There's six candidates running for councilor at large, and you have the opportunity to vote for three of us. So before I begin, I'd like to respectfully ask that you choose me for one of your at three at-large votes in this year's election on November 7th. Uh, a little bit about myself. I've been on the council a number of years, served as city council president a number of years also. Uh, I'm married to Kristen, the former Kristen Peroni, uh, a graduate of Beverly High. I have uh, a daughter, Anna, who's 22 and is a nurse at Beverly Hospital. I have a 12-year-old son named Noah, and he is a seventh grader at Briscoe. And the last of my pack is Julia. She's 10, and she goes to Cove uh, Elementary School. Uh, it really has been a rewarding experience serving on the Beverly City Council the past 16 or so years. Uh, our city is in good financial shape after going through a rough patch in the early 2000s. Uh, some of the good things that we've done, we've redone all the elementary schools. We have a close to brand new high school. And we're right in the middle of our biggest, uh, element, um, our biggest school project, the middle school, which is scheduled to open next September. Uh, it, very exciting for the entire community. Uh, we've done a lot of work in our downtown. There's some positive development around the train station. I think that that's going to be an issue this year as to, while we do appreciate the development and the tax dollars it brings into the city, we have to decide whether how much development is too much and whether or not our schools and our infrastructure can handle so many more people. Uh, it's going to be a busy two years once reelected. We still have to uh, figure out what we're going to do about a public safety facility. Uh, the police have been without a new station. They haven't had a, they, they've been waiting for a new station since I started on the council in 2000. And that building is next in our capital improvements project. Uh, we have to figure out what we're going to do at Briscoe Middle School once it closes. While some people think it would make uh, some, a great spot for some more housing, I think it's something maybe the city may want to hang on to uh, and use as a resource possibly to house some uh, city business in. Uh, we still have to do something with our waterfront. Uh, it's sat long dormant for a long time. The mayor is currently working on another RFP to see if we can get a waterfront restaurant here in the city. Um, I'm really looking forward to serving again, so please get out and vote on November 7th, 2017, and please consider voting for me, your City Council President for Councilor at Large. Thank you.